name is Jack Sepgain, and welcome back to Genocidal Tale, where we have to continue killing every beautiful, glorious little creature in this game. Ah, oh, use the box. Yes or no? Hello. Oh, I forgot I had a ton of stuff. <laughs> it's so much easier to get all the items now because people um, basically bend over backwards for me. This is the box. You can put an item in or take it out. Why would you, though? You can't use items when they're in the box. Sincerely, a box hater. <laughs> oh, wait, yeah, I can walk across that. What is this area again? I can't remember. There's a lot of stuff I don't remember, actually. Mm, by well, I have to continue killing all the characters in the game, sadly. I swore I saw something behind that rushing water. Can I go behind here? There's a camera behind the waterfall. Alphys! Stop staring at me! Stop spying on me like you always do. Uh, I like how we're just starting off with just the water. There's no music in the background. Which is a little eerie, but the sound of the water is really calming. Can I fight people now? I need to kill them all. I think I have to, before the undying fight, undying, not undying. The, before the undying fight, I have to actually kill all the creatures. Because each area is like, oh god. Each area is before the final boss of the area. You have to kill all mm. the characters in that area before that. So, Toriel, Papyrus, yeah. undying. I can't remember the next one after undying. Is it Metaton? Maybe it's Metaton. I don't know. Oh god, now we have to get- So, this one is gonna be undying. Oh wait! Papyrus isn't here now! What, what happened? Music? Papyrus normally came out before and talked to her. Oh god! Wait, I don't have to fight you earlier or anything, do I? No! No! Stop! Um. Oh. Uh, just a tease. Yeah. Weird. Yeah, I see that as just like a tease of like, it's going to go down at some point. Because normally Papyrus comes out and he's like, oh, hey, blah, 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 blah. Poor Papyrus. He's such a sweetheart and I had to kill him. Yo, did you see the way she was? Oh, I was so sad about Papyrus. And it was even more sad because he was like rooting us on. Poor thing. Staring at you, that was awesome. I'm so jealous. She was just standing there waiting for F. All right, <laughs> Sean. I, okay, next time I'm gonna ask you, so come prepared. Don't don't answer now. Answer next weekend. I'm gonna ask you, like best game soundtrack. Okay, so do your research if you don't already have your list. Ever, and then you just, come on, let's go watch your beat up some bad guys. Oh, oh he fell. With a stupid smelly face. Smelly face? 18 left. Things are creepy in here already. Oh, and the puzzle's already done. Mm. It seems like Flowey's helped me with the puzzle. One of the puzzles, it was like, the switch is already being depressed by vines. Which is really cool. Wait, I don't fight Undyne yet, do I? So I oh! Yeah, I can see why. The marker used to be like an exclamation point, wasn't it? When you go into a fight, and now it's just a happy face. As in, like, you're so happy to be fighting these people. Boom, 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 boom! No need for a swimming suit. Because Aaron is a beast. Aaron flexes in. Flex. I think when I first saw so those things, I thought it was clouds. <laughs> Instead of so arms. Bad, killing them all. They're going down so Ooh. quick. So I think I just have to stick around this area then. And I know a lot of people are like, Jack, don't edit it. Don't edit out all the fights. But I have to. There's just me like going back and forth. Yeah, 17 left. Mm -hmm. It's just me going back and forth in the same areas, fighting guys non-stop. So I'm going to edit out all that grinding. So you don't have to sit there Qu and wait. Because I have oh. nothing to talk about during those moments. Question. Um, What do you get? Would you prefer... Like when I start playing the games for like a full on playthrough or edited out so that it's kind of getting to the main bits. I want to know. What do you guys prefer? It's either. I'm just literally doing this, going back and forth. But I am going to leave in all the like the proper dialogue and I leave in all the, the proper bosses. You yeah, you do. Okay, so Zetsu, you do have to kill everyone. That's what was confirmed last stream. You have to kill everyone in the area to get genocide root. You don't want to 
I don't want this series to go on forever again and have to like endure 10 more episodes because it's just not fun to do and I might I might actually make the episodes a bit longer now this time because I, I want to I want to show the genocide run but I also don't want to take forever doing it because I want to start other series again I don't want the series to overlap so lots of reasons let's move up and down so I might cover more ground and let me fight more people can I actually fight anybody in this area I don't know I'm curious if I'm fighting all these dudes and say it says like 12 left if I die and go back to the save point Will it still say 12 left or will it re reset? Because mm. technically, uh, I guess it kind of would because you're resetting the timeline. It's just weird because a lot, of, a lot of games have these like save functions where technically you do go back in time, but very few of them actually made it part of the game, which is really cool about this game. It's like, okay, the save point is not just a thing that's very game specific. It's one of the reasons why I love the game so much is because every aspect of it ties into the story. It's not just like, oh, okay, I can afford to get hit a bunch of times, actually. It's not just like, oh, here's a random game mechanic that just makes no sense. It actually makes perfect sense for... Okay, so I'm looking at the... Your guys' answers for my question of whether to do full playthroughs of games um, or edit it down. And it's kind of mixed, so I'll, I think I'll just kind of go with Mortem's comment which is it depends on the game so i'll probably just depending on the game edit it down and then some i'll keep full we'll just see kind of learn along the way for the for the story of the game the way it works it's really clever it's really well made like every single piece of dialogue was thought about every single little mechanic was thought about it's incredible i really wish i could make a game like this whoa whoa I, I wish I could just write characters as funny as this, or as with much character, like all the little random enemies. Oh, I leveled up. Your love increased, your level of violence. Um, I go back and save so I can get my health back. But oh yeah, the love level of violence. Even the, the miscellaneous random enemy encounters all have so much character. Aaron flexes in, like he actually, like you can almost imagine a kind of character behind that who says that kind of stuff. Oh, only nine left, awesome. And like little Washua who wants to clean everything. He reminds me of the little robot in Wally, -E, who I love because he's so awesome. He's so he's so like he's all over the place and he's so bouncy and he's so lively and everything. I like me. Um, like me. <laughs> when I was at Insomnia over the weekend, that just finished. I, I came back yesterday, but when I was at that, there were so many people dressed as like Papyrus, Sans, Frisk. I made a really cool Undyne cosplay that looked really well made. It's awesome. I love seeing the stuff that's come out of this game. And I, I just love the game a lot. Okay, so after this, there should be seven left. Boom, 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 boom! Aw, oh, poor Mole Small. Sexy widow Wiggle. Oh. Because you can already spare them. And it, it He's killing them so easy. You can spare, any of the bosses you can spare, you can die in one hit. And I think Toriel was trying to spare me, and Papyrus was trying to spare me. I can't mm -hmm. remember. It was something like that anyway. But yeah, the, the cosplayers that I met, it was so cool. Because... I've done games before and met cosplayers from them, or have known games before and met cosplayers from them. But to see them from this game was just something different, because... Cosplayers, he, he means the people who dress up as the characters in the games. Cosplay, right? I think that's right. So a lot of the characters were really special to me, and especially to a lot of people that had so much character in them. So to see them like in real life reincarnate, it was just so much fun. And I did the voice for some of them. I did uh, the panel thing that we did. People were asking me to do like the papyrus voice and that made me so happy as well. Panel? Oh, sounds like he went to convention. Hmm. It was, I don't know. It's just, I, I've done like Fran Bow where I've done voices before or Little Inferno where I've done like Sugar Plumps as yeah. voice. And we people wanted be. me to do it, but it, it wasn't the same as what Undertale is. Because I have a lot of people coming to me saying, anytime I see these characters anymore, I think of your voice for them. And that yeah. makes me really happy. Because, I, I don't know, whenever I look at the characters anymore, I can't think of anything except my own voices for them either. So, because they were so solidified the way I made them. I was so certain about a lot of them the way I did them, that I, I can't think of anything else anymore. Especially Papyrus. Papyrus and Flowey, I just can't imagine any different voices for them. Alphys always mm. has the voice that I have in my head for her now. Uh, I, I don't know. There's something special about it. And a lot of people are like really giddy, really giggly when I did the voices. 
because I, I'm always a big fan of like That's so cute. Say like Rick and Morty. If I met Justin Roiland in real life and heard him do the voice in front of him, I'd be like, oh my god, he did it! So to see some people react that way over voices I did for video game characters is just really cool. Mm -hmm. I was really happy about it. So thank you guys. <laughs> If you ever meet me and want to hear me do the voices, please ask me, because I'm always so delighted to do it. Who is fanboy a small bit? I'm like, yay! I love doing them! Wowie! So many people here to hear me do th Aw. Can't do that voice anymore now because I killed him. That's sad. I'm sad now. There's only one left. And then nobody came. I'm doing it in this area as well. I know I could move on ahead, but I'm just making very sure that I do this properly. Because the genocide run is very easy to mess up and I don't want to meet Undyne yet. Um, I know she's a good few rooms away, but I, I kind of just want to do this like my way and this area is, mm. There's a lot of space to walk around in as well So you can cover a lot of steps just in one area. Yeah, I think he's a lot more cautious to do the genocide route the way it was meant to be because I Think he did say the first time he tried playing it again and killing he didn't kill all of them And so he like had to start over when he started recording so yeah, he's just very cautious. Area without going through different Understandable. Streets. We're running back and forth across the same little tiny patch of grass. But one thing I wanted to talk about was the genocide run in general. And how, like, a lot of games you play are genocide runs. Like, a lot of, not just RPGs, but a lot of games you play are genocide runs all the time. Because video games have made you so conditioned to think mm. that... That's creepy. They've made, them, they've made you so conditioned to think that once you see a, an enemy in the game, you have to kill them. That's why this game really enraptured a lot of people, was that you came across enemies, but you could just talk to them. You could spare them. And then they went along about their happy lives. And that was really cool, but the genocide run is a different story, because not only are you killing them, but you're terrifying all the other creatures in the game. Like, I arrived at Snowden, your reputation preceded you, and then everyone was terrified and left the village. No other game does that. No other RPGs do that. A lot of RPGs are like, you can spare people. Like, you can do a no-kill you can do a no kill run. Like, Metal Gear Solid games do that. Deus Ex, Human Revolution did that. And you can go through the game without killing anybody, and that's cool. But they weren't as different as this. Going through and killing them and not killing them, Dishonored is the same. It's not all that different. You get some story choices which are a little different here and there. But you don't go into an area and it's like all the enemies have left because they're terrified of you. He's so many games are like, no, this area circle. needs enemies because square. the game's gonna be boring now. Whereas this game is just like, oh, no, goes. the enemies are scared of you now and they ran away. Mm -hmm. Which is really damn cool. Well, they're not even enemies. They're just villagers. You might be the last guy I have to kill. It said one left, but two of you showed up. But let's go back to the same point now and one. check. I'm dead. Did the music change? I think it might have. We'll see if nobody came shows up before I get to the save point. If it does, then it means I've done the area properly. Yeah. He was, just, he was just talking. And I know I should be a lot sadder doing this. Uh, and a lot of people have pointed it out too that I'm... I'm yeah, he... I guess now looking at it, um, he was going around in the square trying to find the enemies. He just wanted to make sure he could got every monster and killed them got a little okay. dizzy though that music is haunting and that music's not on the soundtrack either because i had never heard that before until i started playing this one it's scary but a lot of people had pointed out that i seem kind of happy about it saying that i was happy to kill some of the creatures in it i'm not happy about it i just think it's f what do you guys mean by grinding like Bunny, you're saying he's grinding encounters. <laughs> I don't, I don't know what that means. Fascinating to see the differences in it. It's a strain. It's strangely silent. Yeah, of course. Now, whenever the nobody came prompt pops up, it, it pops up like a lot. Look through the telescope. Ooh. Check wall. Okay, yeah, you said that before. Strangely silent, okay. None of the stuff in this area seems to be that different. The wall is already open! What's down here? Nothing, okay. Okay, is that all the same? I think it might be all the same. Yeah, okay. All that stuff is the same, so there's no need for that. I've heard the Undying fight is really fucking hard in Genocide as well. 
I don't know if her attacks change or not, but a lot of people are like, Jack, be prepared. She's a strong character, so it would make sense that her fight's intense and she puts up a fight. Prepared for undying. She's gonna Doesn't sound like she's gonna die in one hit. Kick your ass. So I was like, okay, sorry. Speak of the devil. <laughs> ah, don't hit me. Woo. Ah, shit. I thought I could escape. Fuck, 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 fuck. Because I'm a lot more careless in the genocide run. Ah, I thought I could get down in time. I'm a lot more careless in the genocide run as well because I have far more health. But I think some of the enemies are stronger uh. now. Woohoo! Ah, crap, money hit. Fuck. Whoa! Sweetness! Um, I should probably start pronouncing my character's name as Kara as well instead of Chara because it's supposed to be short for character. Yes. So I, I just you guys saw it as Chara that. before and it seemed to annoy a lot of people. So I'm going to call her Kara from now on. Which, I think that might be an Irish word. I'm not sure. Such a powerful It'll kill sound. the kid. I'm dying so cool. Yeah. Oh no, my eye! <laughs> That's kind of sad. He's not dead. He's fine. See you later. Yes, he's and fine. <laughs> Aw, poor little monster kid. He's so derp. Do I have to kill him? <gasps> Yo, oh. did you see that? The dying just touched me! I'm never washing my face ever again. Man, are you unlucky? If you were just stand if you were standing just a little bit to the left. Yo, don't worry. I'm sure we see her again. That's all the same. I remember that from last time. Moving on. See, I might make these episodes like two hours long now. I don't know, just because I like playing the game so much. Yeah, I remember watching that scene where the the kid dinosaur thing got the the eye. I thought, I mean, we thought he got killed, but he's fine. And I get a lot more covered than that. Oh, Sans isn't here. It's an odd looking telescope. I can't even look through it. What is Sans going to say to me? Because he was super scary before. He was like, you would be dead where you stand. And... Because of some stuff coming up later, and the fact that I killed Papyrus, he's not going to be too happy about that. Use the box. Mm -mm. Yes. Okay, I still didn't use any of my... I, I wonder when Sans is going to come up. I don't know. At this point, it doesn't seem like Sans is going to come up in this episode, but the next. Just because thumbnail-wise, and right now it's all about Undying. Wait, the candies. Ice cream dude isn't here. 21 different flavors. It's empty right now, so there's no punch cards. I can't get any ice cream from my party, dude. Man, all I want was some ice cream. <laughs> the hell is down here? See, I can't no, remember some place. of the pathways, but nobody came. That's going to be the story of my life running through this entire area now. But it's good to have it out of the way, because now I can just wander around freely and I don't have to worry. Look at all them water sausages and lily pads. I think there might be new weapons over here somewhere. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? Yes. You're carrying too much. Okay, I'm a A lot of cinnamon bun. I'll use. I might as well use them. It's a pair of ballet shoes. Will you take it? Yes. The ballet shoes make you faster, I think. Mm. Weapon attack seven. These U shoes make you feel incredibly dangerous. So, remember when I was doing the Omega Flowey battle and I had to dodge ballet shoes that were going up and down? That was this character helped me. I'll put them on. The weapon attack seven, right? What, were, what, were, what was the tough glove? I was weapon attack five, but it was like bam, 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 bam. So you could punch five times. So we'll see how the ballet shoes fare in battle now, which I can't use just yet because nobody came. Hooray! Oh man! Onion sand doesn't show up. That's one of the saddest things I've ever seen. It doesn't seem like oh, onion just... sand! That was, oh, <laughs> onion sand was the best! Look like the biggest derpiest face, and I was so happy. Well, that's yeah. Sucks. The monsters are oh, gone. Scared me. Shiren. Thought I killed everybody. Oh crap. Okay. Yeah, just Wait, slow down. You won. Fifty-two and twenty-five. Is Shiren a boss then? The mini bosses don't count. Ah oh, man, this isn't done. I don't want to do this again. Cause I can't remember. No, I'm not gonna play it. Now, wait, we see if we run into another battle. Can't tell me about sure. Sans. Gosh, we still have to do all this stuff. 
Can I get the umbrella for this? We take an umbrella and we bring it back. I'm so cute! Oh, look at me with little umbrella! Oh, I'm so happy! Jack is so cute. Do that I like the music. Oh. No, I don't need dog residues. I don't need Temi armor. Well, I could get it, but I'm not grinding all that shit again. Wait, how much money do I have? 1581. No, Temi armor costs a fortune. It's like 9999. You have to die a bunch of times to bring down the price. I'm not doing it. I'm not getting Temi armor. Mm. Yo, you can't hold an umbrella either. If you're walking anyway, I guess I'll go with you. <laughs> I just realized my monster kid voice is very similar to my undying voice. Hey, punk! Mm. I wanted to be like, I've always wanted undying to be like, um, uh, Vicky from Fairly Odd Parents. Oh. Like, bad twerp! That kind of thing. I don't know, she has that kind of tomboyish attitude Interesting. to her. She's a bit gruffer. She's hot, though. I think undying's sexy. So, one time we had a school project, okay. the king we had to call a Mr. Dreamer volunteered to donate his own flowers. He ended up coming to school and teaching the class about responsibility and stuff. That got me thinking, yo, donating flowers to the school from his garden where Flowey mm. was born. Bye, Creamy Co. Ah, oh, it's all making more sense now. Maybe we should beat up the teachers. <laughs> oh yeah, this area is really nice looking. And like, their stars are just... Shining rocks. Well, maybe not rocks. I don't know what they are. I do like, like shining that. Shining things on the top of the cave. That's our destination. We have to go all the way there. It's fun. I like this. And I don't know why I can grab an umbrella here. Or maybe you can put back the umbrella. Oh, okay. You want to? Yeah, yeah. Climb on your shoulders. Let me up. Here we go. Boosh. See you later, fucker. Bye. <laughs> so, there's some stuff I still don't know yet because Kara was like the first human that fell into the underground and was like the really bad one. And then Frisk was the one that you were playing as before, which I'm playing as now. But I'm not sure if I'm playing, if I'm turning into Kara or I'm being like possessed by Kara. So I have to figure that out. Determination. Yeah, so it's still. I do like that name, Kara. I. I kind of wrote it down on like I have a list of names that I like I wrote it down not gonna lie it says that maybe Shiren was just a mini boss ah oh, crap I forgot about this part be cool on dying okay I don't want none of your shiz mm. gotta go fast yep boosh <laughs> run I love the whole like 80s like Batman sort of thing like pow, zam, zap. Yeah. Liberty bap. A little I'm bit get hit by any of these. I have a mission. I swear, I'm not gonna get hit. Well, you see, you guys will see by the end of it. Oh god, but you can't slow down either, because they start getting super fast. Oh, it's only one of them. I can't remember where to go. Fuck. Fuck. Ah! Down. Keep going down. Keep going down. Oh. Ain't gonna hit me, Don Don Dine. I don't go this way! Ah, man, come on! Fuck! I thought I had it. No, stay there, Undyne! Your armor's too heavy, okay? You can't do anything, even though you're super cool and strong. Undyne is such like an anime character. Woo! Stop it! Stop it! Stop it! Woo! Mama! Oh, man. Woo! Can't touch me! I have ballet shoes on! I'm super nimble! I'm super quick! Jack, jump over the candlestick! <laughs> no, stop! Stop it! Leave me alone! Okay, end of the line. Get here, come back. And then you should be terrified of me. I'm a scary little baby right now. Oh, we'll have our moment. Don't you worry. <laughs> no! <laughs> oh wait! Oh, now this makes sense. What? What, Jack? Whoa, whoa, whoa! Hold on a second. Cause this is the part where you wake up on golden flowers, and I was like, oh, I wonder who picked me up and helped me. But this is a flashback. 
Huh? This is Azriel finding the first fallen human in at the start of like the very first start. This is him finding Kara and not my Kara, the one I'm playing as right now. This is a flashback from way back when he when the first human fell into the underworld. He's like, it sounds like it came from over here. Oh, you've fallen down, haven't oh. you? Are you okay? Here, get up. And he asks you your name because you named the first human, even in the pacifist playthrough. Which was oh. Sam, but you, we all know it's Kara now. Well, I do because, like, again, I know from Tumblr and different things, and because I searched some stuff when I finished the pacifist playthrough, I saw the name pop up. But, oh man, that's so awesome. That's a nice name. And then it's like, my name is Azriel. But then you find out later, oh, because you wake up in golden flowers. Flowing, oh. Azriel. Okay. All ties together. Amazing. Got it, got it. Oh man, I fucking love this game. I like how it all ties in together. I don't have to. F okay, determination. This is all the same area. Good. I don't have to fight the douchebag dummy. I hate this guy. He's so annoying. I don't hate him. He's funny. And he was fun to fight the first time. Oh, I can't get any astronaut food. I'm carrying too much. I don't need them. Bye, dummy. He's a teleport power, too. <laughs> he was a bit See? annoying. Well, not really, he just goes into the water. It's just like you to run away! I'm a ghost that lives inside a dummy! My cousin used to live inside a dummy too, until... You came along! Yeah, great. Despicable, despicable, despicable! What? Human! That moment of unbridled emotion! It allowed me to finally fuse with my body! I'm hmm? cor fully corporeal now, my lifelong dream realized. In return, I guess I won't stop you. You can spare? Dude! He's oh, a clad he dummy now, he's not the angry dude! And That's it's like very simple. Him. Snaps the block or nothing showed up. Oh boy. Wait, is this just back to the bird? The bird isn't even here. Everybody's scared of me. It seems like the the fights with the smaller monsters are very easy just so that like the main fight in each area can be like more epic and take longer even though papyrus is what wasn't as long it just seems like it's slower no opposite it seems like it's faster to get through all the other monsters doesn't seem like anyone's home undying come out i need to fight you what about naps to block Ah, is that what the ghost TV. was? Most of the buttons are worn away. So the channel changing buttons look good as new. Computers, internet browsers, music sharing forum. Napster, Napster book, yeah. The books aren't here though. The spider web. There's a flyer for a bake sale on it. Oh, don't tell me like. Oh wait, can I go in here yet? No, it's locked. Is there anything up behind these? No, is there a back door? There is a back door, but that's locked too. Everything's gone. Oh man, I can't even thunder snail. It's a lot more boring that no one's there. There's no added conversations or little details. And I know because we know most of the story and stuff. Yeah. Really creepy. Are you still here? Wahaha! <laughs> so you came here. What a treat. Interesting. Can I talk to you? Fate. It's it's interesting that certain monsters stayed around at certain points. Threat fight hero. Long ago, Asgore and I agreed that escaping would be pointless. 
since mm. once we left, humans would just kill us all. <laughs> I felt like a little betrayed when he eventually changed his mind, but now I think maybe he was right too. Because after all, even though we never escape, a human's killing us anyway. Ain't that right? Oh, I guess that answers the question for this so guy. Asgore was afraid to leave the underground in case humans fought the monsters, but now I'm a human in the underground killing everybody anyway. I've lived too long to be afraid of something like you. Try it, kiddo. I know you can't hear. <laughs> Knowledge like that is the only reason I've survived so long. Mm. It reminds That's me a good of point. old man McGucket. <laughs> From Gravity Falls. Eh, fight you. Nah, yeah, he's lived I'm his not life. a hero. Never was. Besides, these old bones aren't fit for fighting any who. Want to take from you the night? Well, at least by talking to you, I bought enough time for some of them to escape. I'm not a hero. I mean, I've turned into Bill Clinton all of a sudden. But I know there's someone out there. Someone who will never give up trying to do the right thing. He no did. He what. did. <laughs> there's no prophecy or legend about anyone like that. It's just something I know is true. Then someone like that will strike you down. Can I kill you? I wouldn't buy your chintzy garbage You're gonna at kill that him. point. Wait, don't you have to kill every monster? You can't, no, you Much don't. Different. Huh. Aw, oh, man. He's not here either. It's not here either. They're not here either. I don't know. It could be a shadow being for all I know. But nobody came? Mm -hmm. Still nobody came. Mm. Hmm. Everything seems the same with So this turtle that turtle guy's name is Gerson. Remember it. Huh. With these. Yeah, everything's the same. I remember reading that one. <laughs> Wait, can I still go to Thames Village? I Please don't tell me sound. I have to fight the Thames. Hey, Dodo. Oh, that would suck. Although it says all the characters are gone. They're not here! Mm. Oh no! Funny, funny. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Should check Tem shop. Oh, there's one Tem left. <laughs> Statue of Tem, very famous, very feeling of being watched. Hmm, <laughs> I'm Tem. Oh, hi. You should check out Tem shop. <laughs> Timmy. Oh, that's okay, Dodo. Let us know how it goes. <laughs> I'm glad you guys are learning things too. I might just leave. I might just go, okay? I don't have to fight Timmy, do I? That was a weird interaction. Why are all the other Tems gone and you're still here? Weird. Damn it! But nobody came. Oh wait, yeah, I have to... Ah, oh, crap. Went the wrong way. I have to go all the way back around. I can't remember where the... Is there a pathway here? I can't remember where, exactly where the pathways are. I don't think there's one here. I think I have to go right on this one up here. Yep. And then all the way down. Ah, there we go. I have to circumnavigate the whole place. But nobody came. But nobody came. Mm -hmm. Just like my birthday parties. Come on, stop with that. See, it pops up a ton of times. But when you need it to pop up, when you're fighting all the enemies, it's like, where is it, bro? I went the wrong way. Fuck. Hi, hi, how are you doing? Hey, Undyne. Mm -hmm. uh, how are you doing? That was, he's cutting a lot, I noticed. So yeah, he's just probably walking around, trying to figure out things. Are you good? Very boring. Shake hands. 
seven. Seven human souls. With the power of seven human souls, our king, King Asgore Dreamer, <laughs> will become a god. With that power, Asgore can finally shatter the barrier. He will finally take the surface back from humanity and give them back the suffering and pain that we have endured. Understand, human? This is your only chance at redemption. Give up your soul, or I'll tear it from your body. Dang. Whoa! Ding, 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 ding. Try it, try it, try it. You wanna go? <laughs> Dang, I'll help you fight. Ah, damn it. <laughs> oh, Dane is right in front of you. You got front row seats to her fight. Oh my god. Oh, oh, I get it. Wait, mm -hmm. who's she fighting? <laughs> squeak, 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 squeak. Okay, that was all the same anyway. Where did you even come from? You're just hiding in the bushes in the wall. <laughs> he was hiding for the Undyne fight, and then he was like, oh, wait, it's you. I get it. Are these all strangely silent too? Yep. Because there's nobody here now. It used to be... There is a prophecy. The angel, the one who has seen the surface. They will return and the underground will go empty. Sorry about that. So, this is I'm where... Waiting. I'm waiting for the action. I forget at which points things are supposed to show up. I... Stuff happens where the kid pops up, but do I have mm. to let him go this time or kill him? I'm not sure. I'm not going to help him. If I help him, that might mess up my run. And Dane told me to stay away from you. She said you you hurt a lot of people. But, yo, that's not true, right? Yo, why won't you answer me? Uh, and what's with that weird expression? Whoa. Uh, oh, man. Man, my, my heart's pounding right out of my chest. What would Undyne do? Oh. Yo, you'd b b better stop right where you are. Because if you want to hurt anyone else, you're, you're, you're going to have to get through me first. And, and... No! You do have to fight him. It's going to happen. Kid's going to die. Oh, so freaking easy. Whoa, 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 whoa. Wait, what? Oh, dang, you're, you're hurt. Wait. Oh my gosh, I'm so confused. Hurt? It's nothing. Next time, listen when I tell you to leave, okay? Did Undyne, like, step in for the kid? She stood in and took the hit. Don't oh. tell me she's dead already. No, she's Undyne, not. I... No, no, no. I'll take care of this. Get out of here. Oh. <laughs> it's nothing. No. S somehow. With just one hit. What is happening? I'm already... Already... Damn it. She's splitting her. Papyrus! Alphys! Asgore! Just like that, I... I failed you! Huh? <gasps> that was it? No freaking way. No! My, my body! Feels like it's splitting apart! Like any instant I scatter what? into a million pieces! This is interesting. But deep, deep in my soul, there's a burning feeling I can't describe. Mm, a burning feeling that won't let me die. This isn't just about monsters anymore, is it? If you get past me, you'll... You'll destroy them all, won't you? Monsters, humans, everyone! Everyone's hopes, everyone's dreams, vanquished in an instant. But I won't let you do that! Right now, everyone in the world! I can feel their hearts beating as Dang, she is taking her moment. She is preaching. One! And we all have one goal! To defeat you! Human! No! Whatever you are! For the sake of the whole world! I, Undyne, will strike you down! Fight! Whoa! 
You're gonna have to try a little harder than that. Oh, Stop. shite! Am I already fighting her? Oh, balls. Wait, how far are we into this? We're not even halfway. Oh, good fuck. Okay. So this is all the same as before. No, it's not. Fuck! You guys already knew. <laughs> oh, this music is different. Fuck! Come on, Jack. Oh, this is awesome! Do what you gotta do. No, nope. so I'm gonna come from some other direction. Oh, fuck! Oh, boy! <laughs> yeah! Perfect hit! It's actually a really good song. This is what a real fight is! <laughs> oh, God, I should be enjoying this! But finally! It's like one punch, man! Finally have a... a uh, Nothing much, honestly. And the spear, like, in her eye. She's so cool looking. Yeah. Uh-oh. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is new. Tiny little box. No escape. Holy fuck, you're strong. Oh, uh, okay. Balls. Jesus Christ. <laughs> Let's be careful, man. <laughs> Fuck! Ah! What do I do? What do I do? I'm gonna have to keep eating. I'm gonna die. Oh, fuck! 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 Yeesh! I'm dying! I'm dying! No! No! You suck! I'm so dead! Ah, fuck, 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 fuck it! Ah, <laughs> no, oh no, no! I don't even have the correct. I can't hear myself enough! Fuck, fuck it, fuck it, fuck it! <laughs> you just gotta. Okay, I am in for a battle and a half! Oh, okay. You cannot give up just yet! Kara, stay determined! That's Asgore's voice. I recognize it like, uh, Jesus Christ, that was tough. So you're just gonna fight again? And I'm way back. Fucking hell, dude. I need a box to get different items out of. Let's try this again, shall we? Ugh. Wait, do I have to go through all of that stuff again? Oh, come on, mm. man. Can I not just skip this? Oh, I can. Boosh. I have to go sit through all of this every time. I better not have to. Ah, there we go. Good job. I'm glad that the the game is kind of aware of that stuff. Be quiet. Undying the undying. No, I don't want to act. I have to fight. Oh god, this sucks. I want to die so many times doing this. Okay, the, the start of it is easy. Okay, perfect attacks are what I need. I'm doing a lot of damage. Also, I can't get Temi armor in this fucking mode. Can't get it in the genocide run. Which sucks. So I really need it. Okay, what's coming first? Oh god, there's too many. Ah! It's so slow as well. Fuck! I don't have enough time to get back my health. Shit, shit, don't get hit. Don't get, don't get hit. He who gets hit eats shit. This is gonna be tough. This is gonna take me a while. Mm. Fuck! I suck! I suck! No fucking brain for this! Okay. God damn! Fuck it anyway, man. Prepare to see me fail this battle a lot of times. Oh, God. Fuck, I'm not good at those! Shit, shit, shitty balls. Shitty, shitty balls. 
All of the shittiest balls. I'm spending my whole time healing and I'm running out of items already to fucking heal. God damn it! Oh, come on, Jack, you fucking idiot! This is not it either. This is not the run. I don't, I, I have fucking no idea. I have no idea! I have no idea! Oh, come on. Oh, he died again. He's... I did a walk of shame back to Gerson, oh the turtle Said guy. What, three times? And I bought some items from him. So, my inventory now, I have a CT, which boosts my speed, and it heals 10 HP. It's not a lot of health, but it's going to boost my speed, which might make it easier to dodge stuff. I also have items equipped. I have the torn notebook and the cloudy glass, clouded glasses equipped. Because they, they do less damage and I have less defense, but what was it that they did? Oh, I'm invincible for longer. So now my speed should be up and I should be invincible for slightly longer. So when I get hit, I won't get hit consecutively. So I might be able to survive things a bit longer. I don't know. I don't know how this is going to work. I don't know if it's actually going to work at all. I have a feeling I'm going to get stuck on this battle for quite a while. Which sucks, because it's probably not the the hardest battle in this run. Yes, yes, yes. Which sucks, because I do less damage, but... I mean, hopefully the, the effects will... The effects will work anyway. Oh, God. I don't even know if this is going to feel any different. Okay. These all feel... That, fe that feels the same. I mean, why wouldn't it? I, I didn't get a speed increase or anything yet. Okay, those ones are simple enough. A, and uh, using the analog stick is so much worse for that. Because there's only four directions they can come from. It's the ones that go backwards that piss me off. Okay. Slow. Ha ha! God! That was scary. Wind is howling. I got this. I got this. I got this. Don't even fucking worry about it. I got this. I got this. Don't get hit by any of these. It's fucking. It's easy time. It's play time with those. I'm doing way less damage though, which is kind of annoying. Ah, come on! I shouldn't have got hit by those. Okay, I'll use the CT. Your speed boost, you recover 10 health. Perfect. Fuck me, man! Ooh, it still that sucks! Out. Jesus Christ, this is a hard battle. Ah! Mm. Sucky, sucky! And now the backwards ones start. Fuck! See, I'm invincible for longer, so I don't get hit by all of them. Can do this eventually. I shouldn't be getting hit by these either. These should be easy enough, but I fucking do because the spears are long. Okay. Ah, I heal now instead of having to heal for two turns. Shit, I waited too long. Shit, 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 shit. Stupid, stupid. I'm running out of fucking. Oh. It's helping me a small bit, but not a fucking lot. Ugh. I hate it. I'm dying. I hate you. I hate you. Gee. Fuck. What? Using the analog stick sucks. Okay, they slowed way down. Analog stick sucks because you point it one direction. When you take your thumb off, it can flick it back another direction. Okay, these are the ones that suck, because they're so slow that you have to be super precise with them. Fuck. Oh, come on, Jack. Ah, ha, ha. Whoa! 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 That's new, that's new, that sucks! Oh! I figured out a pattern. Just go in a circle. Oh. Uh. Running out of health items though. Oh fuck. You should not be getting hit by these. You should be smarter. Fuck you, Undyne. Perfect attack. 
Okay, I got her down to less health than she's ever been at before, but... I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. God fucking damn it! Mm. So suck! Why, man? Why me? Why yeah, I me? guess he thought of everything. Fuck! Oh, it's again, so, was so that hard. fourth time? Okay, I keep trying. I keep trying. I get her. I'm so close. I'm so close to beating her. No, I'm gonna die. No! I got so close! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Come Fuck! I don't have to like three more hits. Stay determined, I know. <laughs> oh, come on. <laughs> I was so close. Oh my god, it's perfect. This is the one. This is the one I'm gonna do it. I've died like 10 times, I think, so far. And all these patterns are set in stone. Those like arrows that pop up and down are all the exact same every time. But there's so many of them that I can't memorize the pattern. I'm useless at it. And I should be able to memorize the pattern by now, but there's just so many of them. The first few are easy enough. It's when the backwards ones come and the really slow ones. And then there's this, the, the circle arrows that pop up. Like these ones suck. Guys, that's so bad. I shouldn't be getting hit by those. So much time. times now that I'm Is starting there? to get bad at it. That you like you develop a pattern and you, you start to get good and good and good and good and bad 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 bad. You should be able to survive those first few rounds no problem. It's like when you're studying uh, people who like have hacked studying or something say that there's a certain amount of hours you need to spend time studying after that it's just like you don't retain any more information so you need to take a break but I don't because I fucking suck I don't know what the numbers got it, are though got it, got it, got it, got it, got it, got it I should be getting perfect attacks but I can't Ugh. okay, got that one perfect, thank you That one's, ah, th I was gonna say that one's easy, but sometimes I fuck it up. Okay, I'm gonna drink a CT, so it brings up my speed. Yeah, even though he's gaming, it kind of goes to the fact, like, um, that he's trying to remember patterns. So that's what I mean. That's how I made the connection. He's trying to learn the patterns, so kind of connects to that. Okay, that, that pattern I know now, because it's the opposite of itself. Perfect! Thank you! This one! This one sucks! This is the one that gets me every time! Cause I fuck it up for myself! Ah! Okay, I got it that time. That's what I've always wanted to do, but I never could! Like, take it easy! I, I run around too much! Wait for it to- Ah, crap, I cornered myself that time. Wait for it to stop, and then make your strike! Boom, boom, busy back. Ah, fuck. Okay, I did better than I normally do there. Fuck! Okay, it's okay. Because this one is easy. Yes. That one's easy enough. I can do it. I'm always like one hit away. This one's easy as well. I'm always like one hit away from doing it. Or two hits. And then I fuck it up right at the end. Because I get panicky. This reminds me of what it's like to fight a Dark Souls boss. Oh, I hate this. Fuck. It tells you which ones are coming and everything. And I still fuck it up and I'm not comfortable enough at 17 health to do these. Okay, this one can be super easy or really fucking hard. You just go in a circle. You go, ah, shit, I messed it up. You go in a circle and you're fine. Oh, at least you should be. Too fast. Just stop oh talking. <laughs> Fuck! I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead, I'm dead. Mm. Come on. Come on. No, 
no, no! <sighs> she was one hit away. I was so close. <sighs> Fucking hell. Come Stay on. determined. Yes! Oh, finally! Oh my god! Oh, I need a second. Oh, I'm supposed to be sad right now, aren't I? That I killed Undyne. Yeah. Look at my fucking hands, man. That took forever. I was literally playing that for an hour and a half. Oh, my God. Oh, my heart is pumping so fucking hard right now. Sorry. Oh, I'm so relieved. Okay. <laughs> Damn it! So, even that power, it wasn't enough? <laughs> if you, if you think I'm gonna give up hope, you're wrong! Cause I've got my friends behind me! Yes, Alpha's told me she would watch me fight you. And if anything went wrong, she would evacuate everyone. By now she's called Asgore and told him to absorb the six human souls. And with that power, this world will live on. Whoa. But her heart didn't burst. Hmm. It's the same with Papyrus. Normally when they die, their heart pops up and then it shatters into pieces. Oh, man. And I know I should be a lot sadder right now, but because the battle took so long and it was so... It was such, like, a hard battle to do. Oh, I'm so, like, drained right now. My hands are shaking. My... I have, like, pins and needles in my hands and my feet. That was a good battle. Undyne did not die in vain. That was a long, hard-fought battle. And that feel Again, it's like a Dark Souls battle where you try so damn hard. You learn their moves, but sometimes you... I think... Uh, no, but I think if I play the game, I get to experience her hard work more than just, like, an edited version of it. Um... So I'm sure when I play the game, I'll have more of an encompassed opinion about the the characters because right now Jack's showing just kind of the main thing. So I can't really get a, a good understanding of the character herself. You mess up and then you get worse and worse. But and she worse tried and really hard. So finally, I, somehow, you magically, know, you beat. I respect that. Beat them. But that's uh, maybe she's not dead. I don't know because she didn't die when I hit her first. She, she had determination in her, the way I do, and that brought her back to life. And now, I don't know, maybe she is dead. But, it, like, she didn't die in vain. Even when she was battling you and she failed, she still let Alphys get some time to evacuate everyone. So let's go see what happened. Mm-hmm. Undyne was, like, the true hero of the story there. And I was the bad guy. This is normally where you fight Undyne. Like, normally you get to Undyne and you think she's a bad guy, but then when you figure out that you can spare her, you figure out she's, like, a super strong good guy. And that you were the bad guy all along. Well, in this run, it seems that way. Or maybe not. Am I just going straight into Hotland? Oh, God. Dude! Sans isn't here, either. Sans is nowhere anymore. That sucks. Take a cup of water. There's nobody to give the water to now because you normally give it to Undyne. What happens to it? The water evaporated from the heat. The cup evaporated too. <laughs> Dude. 40 left. Good God. And That's the guys aren't of... here. Oh my gosh. Two... That's a lot of monsters. The guards aren't here. Wait, is that... Okay, so the water person is here. I am the river man. Or I am the river woman. Doesn't really matter. I love to ride in my boat. Would you care to join me? Ride in the boat? No. 
I've known. Oh wait, yeah, 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 yeah. I will. I'm gonna go back to Snowden, huh. and I'm gonna get a bunch of Cinnabons again. Cause I realized I wasted all the snowman pieces, which give you a ton of health back. They give you like 25, I think. Tra la la. Did you ever hear the whole song? The old song coming from the sea? No. What song? Okay, and I was like checking my emails in between all that. I need to bring back up my audio in the background. Cause normally when I play, I have like uh, audition in the background just to make sure that my um my my thing is still working, that my audio is still working, it doesn't cut out. Because if it does cut out, then I'll have to stop and restart everything to make sure it's okay. Is nobody here? Sans? So... Nothing for you. So there's another... Another main boss we have to fight. That's what I'm gathering here. Nothing for you. Nothing for you. Of course, nothing for me. I'm, I'm trying to think who. Oh, there's nothing left. Yeah, take Cinnabon. Yes. So, I used that the Manly Bandana equipped. It gives me two plus defense over what I have now. But the one now gives me um, more invincibility frames. So when I get hit and the heart flashes and I can't be hit again, I'll just save it. Then, I'm able to, like, survive attacks a lot longer. So, that's what I have now. Is my, and my stuff is still recording. Okay. So, I've been recording for... Very long time. I've been recording for two and a half hours now. That Undying Battle took so long. Oh my gosh. Oh man, it sucks that all like the, the like really cool characters. Oh wait, I'm not doing the right thing. Care for a ride? Right in the boat, yes. It sucks that all these characters you become beloved with and that you care At so the very much end. about. And then you the just kill them end. in cold blood. It'll all come together. Ta la la, Timmy Village. The room before the darkening lantern room. Let me just pause, though, because you're saying context clues. So there's been clues coming up with who we're going to fight. I want to think. I want to get it. I, I want to get it before it comes up. You know, I want to be like that in tune with the details. But it's so hard. I don't know. I don't. <laughs> I like that character. At least sometimes you have to kill you. That would suck. Okay, I'm gonna continue playing. I was gonna end it after this, but I've, like, because stuff is more edited now, I have no idea how long the episodes are gonna be, so I'm just gonna keep playing and make it a longer episode. Wait, I'll save here, in case I die. 40 oh, I have to grind, still. and I kill a bunch of people. I don't know, I have to look up who the next boss is. Oh, I can't go through there anyway. Look up who the next boss is not to pass. Um, okay, so it's Metaton. Because I, I am kind of, I'm not really cheating, but I have to know who the next boss is so I don't stumble upon them accidentally. Wait, Metaton here? Do I have to fight people like right here? I don't think I can fight people right here, can I? Okay, let's go into the lab anyway. I have it saved, so if I mess something up, if I start a Metaton battle, I can just stop and go back. Everything's is easy. Oh, Metaton? wait. It's a computer. It's accessing some kind of puzzle in Snowden. Is she helping with the puzzle? Seems like no, it's to something, but it's all is written it? in chicken scratch. Uh, it seems like a walkthrough to a game, or... Or what? It's a beat-up figurine of a female with human cat ears. The fridge is filled with instant noodles and soda. Take a package of noodles? Nah, I have, I have better stuff. No, they're too funny. It's a half-envy bag of dog food. You just remembered something funny. Because the amalgamates were all like... Remember one of the amalgamates was like a ton of dog... And you guys say, like, who's missing? Everyone is freaking missing. I know Sans is missing. Is it Sans? Hugs. And it was back when you went. Oh, wait, the hole in the wall is already there. Oh, there you are. You ugly little creature. You've made quite a name for yourself. Such infamy. Like I'm impressed. Oh, yes. If you're looking for Alphys, she's not here. While you were busy doing your, ahem, uh, thing, she was running around evacuating people to safety. Now they're in a place where you'll never get them. Deciding to fight you, my, my, she really is only the smart one. The only smart one, isn't she? I just keep she? watching and see. Oh, my character's like moving towards them. Oh, how sassy. You're just itching to get your hands on me. Aren't you? Well, 
Too bad. This world needs stars more than it needs corpses. Toodles. He just ran away? Hmm. Okay. Dude. So he's not the boss. Okay. Can I go into the true lab? No, oh, come on. It's a bathroom sign. It's not a bathroom though. It's true lab. Anything different in here? No. I think everything's pretty much the same. The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats and a single clean dress. Oh, yeah, because she wore the dress on the date with Undyne. Oh, yeah. That's Man, cute. it's so sad! Because Alphys knows Undyne's probably in trouble now and had, like, like bad stuff happen to her if she told her to evacuate if stuff went south. There are letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. Because... Oh! When not in use, this bed falls into an extremely easy to draw box. <laughs> because, remember, the family of the amalgamates were sending her letters. Mm-hmm. And About then all the monsters. She, or their she didn't, like, respond or to them. Because she was ashamed of what had happened. Yeah. A garbage can, but it's pretty cute. Ah, oh, so all the, she, all the letters from the families are still there for the amalgamates. That's a nice touch. Do I have to fight people in here? I have to find the area where I can fight people and then just stay here and grind. Okay, Vulcan strolls in. Boom, boom, boom! Whoa! Easy. I might be overpowered. The music's all different too. The music's all like slower versions. Whoa! Oh god, it's so creepy! It's fascinating at the same time. Okay, 39 left. Okay, same area. So I should probably just hang around here and fight people. I need to go mm. get items though. There's a frying pan down here, I think. Sunder plane! No! Sunder plane is so cute! It's not like I like you! Aww. Why do I have to fight? Ugh. Almost got hit. Yeah. Close call. Oh, oh god. Whoa! Oh. Dang, plane crash. Holy crap. shit! <laughs> oh god! An actual literal like plane crash! Okay, um, okay, the, yeah, the frame pang's over here. Oh, I'm carrying too much shit. Uh I'll drop one of these. I'll use it. Who cares? It's better to use than drop. Uh, will you take it? Yes. So, what does this do? Uh, burn pan! Burn pan, weapon attack 10, damage is rather consistent. Consumable items heal 4 HP. Yes! Seems like a very good item. Definitely! Mm -hmm. what, what, what did the ballet shoes do? How, how, ballet shoes, weapon attack 7. These shoes used to make... Use shoes make you feel incredibly dangerous. So I have, I have three more attack now. Uh, what's over the fire side? Here you guys oh, comments. Whoops. So funny. Oh, nothing. <laughs> Never mind. Moving on. So I feel incredibly powerful, huh? How powerful? I like when he hops. Let's just Hop. find out. I, wa I wanna... Oh no, that was the other thing. Oh, Alphys isn't here to stop the puzzles or anything. So all the lasers are just turned off. Mm-hmm. That's so weird. Press it. Lasers were reactivated. So did she turn them off to evacuate people? I probably shouldn't probably. go too far, right? I should probably just stay in certain areas and fight. Do I even have to do the puzzles anymore? Or is the doors all open? Oh! Oh! No, that's a boss. Those are like mini bosses. I... Oh wait, Metatom was the guy I had to get to. Just to be sure, I'm gonna hang around here and fight people. There's only one left. Who's it gonna be? Whoa. Who's gonna be my last victim in Hotland? Oh god, I didn't mean to step on that. He's killed four, no, <laughs> okay, 39 so far. I think we can just so go far. up here anyway, and run around this little area. Because I want to, uh, usually the boss's dialogue, or the mini boss's dialogue will all change before the end. I guess that's, I mean, it makes sense if there's so many monsters to kill. Of course they're going to be pretty fast. Like, almost die in one hit. Enemies are dead. So I want to see what the, the two iron guys do. Uh, are they iron? I have no idea. Let's go back. Whee! Oh, whooshy whoosh! Because that's what it says, right? Oh, well, it says one left here, but it, it normally says the whooshing of the vents fills you with determination. And then the first time I played it, I said, Oh, whooshy whoosh! Which now I can't, because now I'm all evil and scary. 
Come on, run into an enemy. You see, this is what happens in the parts that are edited out. Fighting 40 enemies, just going like this. Back and forth, back mm -hmm. and forth. So you don't really miss much in all the parts that are edited out. I know a lot of you would like to see them, but the series would just go on for so long if it did that. Come on, find That'd someone. Like so. Yeah. Oh, it's a Sunday plane. Oh, such a violent death. Determination. Okay, so that's everyone in this area change. How much do you want to bet now with the but nobody came thing? I'll keep popping up super quick now. Ah, oh, damn game. Making me run around. Okay. I forgot there was a laser room. But I don't think you can Does fight anything here. Come can you? Back? Because I, I was going back and forth for ages here and I couldn't find anyone. Or is it Metaton? So I figure I, I don't think you can fight anyone in the puzzle rooms. I think there's only designated rooms that you can do it in. And I'm curious. Forward. I'm curious to see if all Metaton stuff is gone. Hey, dudes! You're here! So that means Undyne, she's like, Undyne, we'll avenge you! Oh, they're gonna avenge her! Oh, yeah, because they're the Royal Guards. Oh, crap, that was bad attacks. Whoa! N number one, you. Good God, I destroyed him. Whoa, 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 whoa! It Calm down there, Royal Guard mom. number two! Good Christ! I just okay. mowed through them! Poor oh things. man, but they were gonna be in love! Yeah. He's not even here. It's a fridge. It's strangely warm. Metaton's not even here! That's great if you're a microwave mm -hmm. fan. It's an oven. It looks pretty modern. Can I take the tin of food now this time? It's glued to the table. So I could never get it? Metaton, you ass. <laughs> Okay, let's keep going into the that core. I think weird. Hotland and Core all count as one area in the Genocide playthrough. I wonder if Heat's Flamesman is still here. Please select the location. I can go to all of them? Aren't you normally not able to go to all of them? Mm, yeah. Uh-uh. Mumford's not even here. It's a spider donut. It looks more rubbery than usual. It's just a croissant. They weren't even real. Oh, I want a croissant. I ain't buying your bullshit. I ain't afraid of no ghosts. So what's on all the other floors? I don't think it really matters now because I killed everyone. I want to go back and check. Just make sure because I don't want to mess up this playthrough. It's so easy to mess oh, it up. Oh, I want to know. And I just want to make sure. How much time? And I, I can't remember what was on the other floors. Oh, uh, let's go left floor two. I'm on left floor three now. I think it was just all. Oh, it's a force field. You can't go there. All blocked off, dude. Well, th maybe that's why I can choose them all. Because normally this area is to help you like get to know Alphys, and she helps you through all the areas. So if she's not here, I mean she's not dead or anything. I don't think I will be able to kill her because you don't fight Alphys. Oh God, that would really cripple me if I had to fight Alphys. Oh god, I messed it up. Did I mess it up already? I forget what you're wait, supposed to where do, do here. Go? Oh wait, down. There we go. From downtown. I'm gonna go over here, over here, over here. So don't go up. Up is for more puzzles. Because all hmm. the other floors are puzzles as well, but the puzzles are all done. Okay, I think I have to fight Muffet now. Just says determination. Are the spiders gonna be hanging from the roof? Yes. Did you hear what she said? They said a human wearing a striped shirt will come through. I heard that they hate spiders. I, I heard like that his they spider love voice. to stomp on them. T it's true this time. I heard that they like to tear their legs off. Because before it was like, no, I don't. I don't want to die. But now it's kind of true because I kill everything. I heard. I heard you spin me. Okay, Muffet's still here then. That they have some awful taste. Do you what have to a shame fight? that a human comes through and they aren't even fit to be eaten. Oh well, rotten ingredients can't can always be discarded. Wait, do I not Oh I do fight you. <laughs> ba, 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 ba. Oh, one of the best songs in the game. What happens? Oh I don't even have the spider stuff on me, so I can't use Dodo. it anyway. 
Let's fight her. Uh -huh. They all die in one hit. Well, except on dying. <gasps> what are you doing? Where are you going? What? What? Oh, oh little flower. No. <gasps> oh. My oh, heart. It's so cute and sad. He brought in a little flower for her. Oh. And then it said you won. Don't you just feel horrible? Yeah, got a little emotional. That oh, was sad. Oh god. Oh god, I feel dirty. Wait, so none of this stuff happens? We're we're going through this really fast, oh, guys. Oh god. And he's walking through. It's pointless now. Wait, where does down go? So I don't have to do any of this. This is nuts. See, if you did a, a genocide playthrough for the very first time, as your first time through this game, yeah, there's nothing here, you would miss out on so much. You miss out on so much of the character arcs. You miss out so much of the personality of the characters. Mm -hmm. Personality of the game, even. You don't get to do any of the puzzles. That would suck. I'm already at the hotel, Jesus. Go up the creepy alleyway to the right for some great deals. Are you guys still going to be here? But like, nobody came and stuff. Now I can take the mystery key, probably to someone's house, lol. It goes to the house next to Na Okay, we don't have a lot of time left. I'm just kind of trying to put pieces together. I don't see, if you guys are saying the next fight is like really hard my guess is he's just walking through everything until he hits sands and he has to fight sands and then he'll end it there and that's what we'll come back to next week blocks. that's what people were telling me oh we get plus seven defeats empty gun plus two attack bullets not included sweet okay so i'm going to seal he saw five gold from the till you guys don't have anything. Is there a box nearby? I want a, I want a box nearby so I can go there and buy a bunch of shit. It's just a regular wall. <laughs> Is everybody going to be gone out of here? So creepy. Okay, I got my box. Um, CT and the ballet shoes in there. Uh, it's in the bottom because I have to buy... I'm gonna buy all the stuff in here. Good God. We're powering through this playthrough. I don't know how long this episode is either. Because there's lots of stops and starts. So I don't know how long I've been actually talking for. So, uh, take, empty gun, cowboy hat, and mystery key. Just take, take, take. Hey, this is Braddy. Hey, this is Caddy. If you're reading this, then, like, bad news, you mega evil weirdo. <laughs> Alphys just came here and she's taking us. Someplace super duper safe? Oh, wait, does Alphas come and take everybody then? Like from Snowden as well, maybe not. But first, we gotta use up these gel pens. Yeah, chill, Alphas. We don't I loved gel pens growing up. Those are so don't fun. They always smell though. And don't even think about stealing our stuff. Yeah, creep. Leave our junk alone. Caddy, it's not junk. It's really valuable. Yeah, our garbage is, like, really valuable. Mm. Anyway, in closing, you're a total loser. Yeah, loser. Yeah. Sign Braddy. Sign Caddy. <laughs> His voices for them are pretty on point. How much money do I have? 3,883. Um, okay, so equip you. You equip the empty gun. Sweet. And I equip the cowboy hat. Sweet if I could wear the cowboy hat and empty gun. Okay, uh, use the box. Yes. Put you back and put you back. I can't put you back. Take a center button. Put you back. There we go. I kind of want to go back and use the mystery key. Does it open this? It's locked. Okay, so... Use. You use the mystery key. The red house's oh, door was locked. Like yes! The key disappeared. Oh. Yeah, because he wasn't able to go in there. Fiery. My dear, my diary collection is going fabulously. I have like five now. Dear diary, she surprised me with something today. 
sketches of a body she wants to create for me. A form beyond my wildest fantasies. In a form like that, I could finally feel like myself. After all, there's no way I can be a star the way I am now. Sorry, Blucky, my dreams can't wait for anyone. Metaton? My darling diary. I met someone interesting today. Oh wait, I'm, I'm reading them all wrong. Sorry. Read this one first. Dear diary, Shiren's sister fell down recently. Who's Shiren's sister? It's sad. Without her sister to speak for her, she's become more reclusive than ever. So I reached out to her and told her that she, Blucky, and I should all perform together sometime. She seemed to like that idea. Oh, because Shiren is a singer. <laughs> Dearer diary, I like to buy a new diary for every entry I make. I love to collect diaries. You can Dearest tell. diary, our cousin left the farm to become a training dummy. That leaves just Blucky and I. Blucky asked me if I was going to try to become corporeal too. They sounded so resigned. Come on, Blucky. You know I'd never leave you behind. And besides, I'd never find the kind of body I'm looking for anyway. My darling diary, I met someone interesting today. Last week I posted that advertisement for my human fan club. Today was our first meeting. Only one other person came. Oh. Honestly, she's a dork. And she's obsessed with these awful cartoons. But she's kind of funny, too. I want to see her again. It's Alphys! Yeah. Diary, my dear. My diary collection is going fabulously. I have, like, five now. She surprised me with something today. Yeah, and then the body. Whoa! Okay, so Metaton was a ghost. Along with Napsablock and his cousin. And they were going oh. to do something with Shiren. And Metaton wanted a new body to be, cor to be corporeal like his cousin. But he could never find the body that he wanted. Then he met, he had a human fan club. And he, Alphys joined it. And then Alphys mm. told him that she could make a body for him. And now he became Metaton. Like the body that we knew. The square body. And then he became, oh, yes. That means I read all the diaries, arseways and wrong. Can I go past? I want to go past. I want to see if there's anything else oh, I can read. Oh, that's interesting. I can't go in any further. Oh, man. So that's the herb. That's the block of Metaton used to be together. And Metaton used to be a ghost. Until he was put into the machine. And then he got the human body. Cool! That adds a lot to- Oh crap, I went to Snowden, didn't I? That adds a lot more to Metaton now. I'm trying to think- I'm like, I'm thinking in my head all the stuff that happens with Metaton. Eat a mushroom every day. Why? That means I know you're listening to me. I'm trying to think of all the stuff that happened with Metaton then to see if it tied in with that. And maybe that's why Napster looks so sad, because everybody left. Or maybe he was just sad anyway. Uh, we're going to hot Sorry. Fascinating! Wow! That's cool! Burger Pants is still here. Why do I always get the freaks? He's still buy so He's still the same. <laughs> ah, yes! I really want to buy your weird, dusty artifacts. Not! Why do I always get the freaks? Evacuation? The faces, I still make me uncomfortable. You're yanking my chain, little weirdo. So what if everybody else left work? So what if nobody's buying anything? Par for the course, little weirdo. Par for the course. Hey! <laughs> well, Metaton didn't tell me I had to work, I guess. But that's the thing! Sometimes he doesn't even call me into work until halfway into my shift! If I don't play it safe, He's going to yell at me. <laughs> okay, maybe yell is the wrong term. It's more like he has this CD album he plays. <laughs> it's entirely full of songs and how bad I am at my job. <laughs> I love how much he changes every time. Huh? Everyone else is dead? <laughs> Does that mean I don't have to work today? <laughs> God. <laughs> that it were true, little weirdo? That it were true. Sorry, little weirdo. Threats won't work on me. I can't go to hell. I'm all out of vacation days. Oh, wow. It's because the, the shopkeepers, you can't attack them. Like, there's no battle sequence. So I can't get to them to attack them. So maybe that's why they're all alone again. Maybe that's why they're all, like, confident about shit. The elevator is in use. By who? Everyone's dead and evacuated. Or are they? Can I just power through this place then? 
Get to Metaton. <laughs> so many of you love him. Uh, whoa, the burger pants. Whoa, I fucking can. Character. Whoa. Okay. Oh, my, my, so you finally arrived. After our first meeting, I realized something ghastly. You're not just a threat to monsters, but humanity as well. Oh my, that's an issue. You see, I can't be a star without an audience. And besides, there are some people I want to protect. It's so creepy how, like, Charo or Karak walks towards all the bosses. Ha ha ha, eager as always, eh? But don't touch that dial. There's something you haven't accounted for. As any true fan would know, I was first created as a human eradication robot. It was only after becoming a star that I was given a more photogenic body. <laughs> However, those original functions have never been fully removed. Come any closer and I'll be forced to show you my true form. Love the true Fine form. Fine then. Ready. It's showtime. Is he just going to transform into Metaton X now? Whoa! Yes. Metaton Neo? Uh-oh. I might not be ready for this. Fucking hell, that is like... His face. Holy fuck, it did like a bajillion damage. G guess you won't want to join my fan club. Hmm. <laughs> Sorry to think I was right. Oh my god, you don't even get any fucking closure with them. You just feel like a beast. You just feel like a true monster just powering through them all and slaying them down instantly. It's so unfulfilling, which is the point of the whole thing, and it's awesome that way. Yeah. But, oh god, I feel all cold and dark and dead inside. Oh, okay, well, I'm gonna leave this episode here. We made some, like, yep, yep, yep. sweet, leaping progress. I'm already, like... I was right, I was right. <laughs> like, second kind last of. episode where I was in the other one. Oh, no, third last episode. Where I was in, like, the pacifist playthrough. Like, two episodes into the genocide run. Good god, you just mow through everybody. Good Christ, I, I feel so dirty playing this. I feel like I'm not... Uh, so I'm not dirty. getting any, like, time with any of the characters. Yeah, it's so weird because you're going into it like thinking these are the bigger characters we had to deal with before but they're nothing now there are only certain characters that are still going to be difficult to fight so you don't get to like you don't get like a sweet send off with any of them you're not like tearing or anything it's just so because it's also just to let you guys know the next weekend stream I was just like remembering I have like an event to go to on Saturday so it may not happen till the following weekend or I may push it to Sunday so I'm unsure at this point I hope so I hope I can do it Sunday cold. you feel even emptier than if it dragged out for really long oh god I don't know how I'm gonna be able to finish this but anyway thank you guys so I don't want to wait episode, if you liked oh it punch that like button in the face like, like a boss! And I face all around. Thank you guys, now we'll see all your dudes! Kind of, maybe. Ah, shit. Yeah! Goo goo! Oh, DL, that's okay. Ah! Love to see what you're drawing. I got this, I got this, I got this. Ah! Yes! I thought I'd feel like. like sadder killing all the characters, but you just feel so. Like, unattached to any of them when you play it this yeah. way. It's nuts!